Hey, what's up guys? Um, it's Ritzy here back in another video and I'm going to be showing you guys in this video how to reduce input latency, get bet get rid of mouse acceleration in Fortnite specifically, boost FPS and maybe even reduce input delay. I don't think there's anything in this video that will reduce ping, but heck, maybe it'll work for you. So, <laughs> we're just going to go ahead and right um click your uh Windows and your R button. Run. If you can't do that, just type R U N. And click on Run. And you're gonna type in here percentage sign local app data. And you're just gonna click on a, another percentage sign. So percentage sign local app data percentage sign. Just go ahead and press OK. Now, if you did my last video, then you'll click on Fortnite game one. If you you didn't do my last video, which I highly suggest, and will probably be on the screen sometime soon in the top right then go ahead and click your regular Fortnite game but I do suggest watching my last video before doing this but yeah so um Fortnite game one saved um config windows uh crash before and just highlight everything in here and delete it because that's just like stuff that doesn't need to be there and then um windows client go ahead and double click that right click game and user settings go to properties uncheck read only apply okay double click game and user settings now first thing we're going to do is we're going to go click on edit and we're going to click on find we're going to click on show grass we're going to click find next um now it's going to say show grass and you want that to be false uh, it might be on true already, but I suggest just changing that to false. Uh, next thing that we're going to do is we're going to click on uh, edit again. And we're going to click on find. And we're just going to type A D I A U D I O, my bad. A U D I O audio. And we're going to click find next. Audio quality, right? Um. Where is it at? Uh, okay. You want your audio quality? It should. It's gonna either be on one or zero, and you can change that to two. Yep. And then, yeah. Next thing that we're gonna find is you're just you're gonna scroll down until you see the SGs and your scaling scalability groups. And you're gonna change your shading quality to zero. And yeah, that's good. And then you're gonna go down, or anything down here I can change now. You're gonna click up here on your edit again. You're gonna click on your find, and we're gonna click on disable, and type disable in there, and click find next. Uh, uh, did I what? Um, okay, well. It's not finding it for some reason. It can't find it for me, but it'll find it for you. Um, and then scroll around. I'm gonna find disable. I just saw it. Sorry about this. Mm, I cannot find disable. Um. Okay. Well, um, skip disable. We're gonna find uh, display gamma, and it should be on 2.000. So you're just gonna change that to one dot zero 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 one dot five zeros. And yeah, and then after that, we should be able to find. Um, I'm gonna click this. Edit, edit, come on, edit, and I'm gonna click find and, and then click uh so you're gonna type in B and disable. Find next. Yeah, B disable mouse acceleration. And I mean who wants mouse acceleration? Yeah, we're gonna put that to true. T R U E. I'm sorry that it took me so long to find that, but I'm gonna say that's all for uh, Fortnite's fault. <laughs> um, 
but yeah after that you're just gonna click file and you're gonna click save and go ahead and press exit out of it you can click properties check read only and apply and okay and you're good now I mean you can go ahead and launch your game but please like and sub to this video um yeah I'm out